is a man who knows all about opportunity. Before moving to America, he grew up in a poor Honduras village. As an American, he spent 20 years serving our country in the Air Force, and now he continues his noble work as a fifth grade history teacher. I cannot think of a more worthy contestant. Please welcome Ed Cavallero from Fort Worth, Texas. I'm doing great, Ed. You really are sort of the American dream. As I said, you grew up in Honduras in a hut, dirt floor, right? Dirt floor. Outhouse, yes. the whole uh, thing. The whole thing. And your grandmother, she was here? Uh, she moved here. I uh, moved to Boston. Saved up enough money for my mother, and my mother saved up enough money for her kids, and here we are. And you all came over here. You became a citizen, came joined citizens, the Air Force. Did doing the most noble job that any person can do, being a teacher in America. Good for you, Ed. We're glad to have you here. And you have, I bet, a lot of life experience that goes into teaching those classes, right? Absolutely. Um, the Air Force, uh, great opportunity for anybody that doesn't really know what they want to so do. So you traveled all over and you bring that experience back to the classroom? Absolutely. And oh, the places you're still going to see with this Capital One check for a million dollars, which I want to give to you, all right? Then? That is my goal. Yep. You're just 15 questions away from the million dollars. You have three lifelines to help you. And when you get to the $25,000 mark, you will get our switch the question. So I gotta ask you, Ed, are you ready to play? One deep breath and I will be. I'm ready. Okay. Audience, are you ready? I took my breath. Let's play million there. This is for $100, Ed. Which of these phrases usually precedes the playful warning, don't let the bed bugs bite? Good luck. Good night, goodbye, get the fly swatter. That would be the final answer. Yes, it is. You have it right for $100. Going for 200 What billiards term is used as a synonym for the word bald? Bank shot, scratch, cue ball, corner pocket. That would be C, final answer. Yes, cue ball. In a Western omelet, ham, onions, and green peppers are cooked with what? Eggs, dough, pasta, lettuce. That would be a final answer. Yes, of course it's the eggs. This is for 500, Ed. In comic books, police often summon what hero by projecting his symbol into the sky with a giant searchlight? Captain America, the Incredible Hulk, Spider-Man, Batman. Little Benjamin would be very angry with me if I do not answer Batman as my final answer. Is he your son? My grandson. Oh, okay. Well, you're not wrong. You got it right for $500. <laughs> on for $1,000 here, Ed. An infirmity affecting millions of Americans, intermittent explosive disorder, often triggers what? Narcolepsy, road rage, night blindness, Lockjaw. That would be something I think a lot of people experience. Uh, be road rage. Yes, it is road rage. <laughs> Good job, Ed. You got your first thousand under your belt. Can't leave it less than that. Going for two thousand. Measuring up to 14 feet, the Alpen horn is a wooden horn traditionally used to call cattle in what country? Greece, Canada, Switzerland, Brazil. Alpen horn. That would tell me it was probably in the Swiss Alps. Alpen horn. Yes, Greece, the way it's made up. That would be C, Switzerland, final answer. It is Switzerland. You have $3,000. Good job, Ed. Going for $4,000. 9 away from a million. In the 1950s, which of these baseball teams temporarily changed its name to avoid any association with communism? Detroit Tigers, Cleveland Indians, New York Yankees, Cincinnati Reds. I think I'm going to ask the audience. No problem. Audience, Ed needs your help. If you're ready, vote now.
Okay. Well. Sort of between Detroit and New York, don't you think? One of those. 95% believe it is the Cincinnati Reds. It's a good number. Let me think. <laughs> I, it's right there in front of me, isn't it? Got to trust the audience. D, Cincinnati Reds, final answer. It was right in front of you. You're right. You got it. All right, Ed, this is for 8,000. In 2006, Lance Bass announced he was gay after years of being in the closet as a member of what boy band? In Sync, Backstreet Boys, 98 Degrees, O Town. You know, I'm not a huge fan of this band, but my two daughters, Alyssa and Ashley, would just die if, it not, if I did not get this correct. It would be A in Sync, final answer. You're right. It is in sync. You have eight thousand dollars. It's going for sixteen thousand. We can back a more millionaire.